morning, galactic beings. <laughs> Sorry. Like something just had me say good morning, Vietnam, and then I know it's not morning, but anyway, get a hoot out of that. Cosmic Christy here. How are you guys doing? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So let's talk about this. A lot happened today. And here's how I know this, because this is how it came into my life. This is how I manifested a fear that came back into my life that I was being tested on. I'm gonna tell you how I recognized it and now by the afternoon have cleared it. I'll have some repetitive, but for now I'm cleared from the whole reason I couldn't stop crying this morning. But there's a reason for that too. So let's talk about that first. This morning, oh my gosh, I can't tell you exactly what time. I guess it started around, for me, I'm Central Standard Time in US. So I got up, I got my kid ready for school. Somewhat just kind of in a daze, I guess, maybe feeling a little dreamlike. It was very, it's very strange. I really didn't have any emotion feeling, kind of maybe more like a zero point energy, I guess, now that I'm talking about it. I wasn't doing my normal human huffing and puffing, I know that. I just kind of did what I needed to do. And then when I got home, like all of a sudden, about 8, 30, 9 o'clock, and I'm getting these turquoise energies right now all around me, around 8, or 8 30, 9 o'clock Central Standard Time, like my heart got broken. I just started crying. I, 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 couldn't stop and there was something in my human life that I had taken kind of a victim thing to that I'm working a lot on clearing that but you know no matter how you block out some things and that's another topic that we need to discuss um, are these um, why these things are popping up in your life right but in this one, you know, I recognized that we had a collective shift. And the reason I'm so late doing this video is because it happened when Venus hit at 13 Sagittarius. Now, you guys just know me as Cosmic Christy. My tribe, me tribe members know me as Christy Birch, I'll go ahead and put it out there. I am the same. But if you look at my astrology, um, I have a lot, lot, a lot of Libra. So I have Sun, Moon, Mercury, Mars, Pluto, in Libra, and I'm an Aries rising. So I feel Venus. And I've been working with Venus um, and, and feeling her energy because I also know that that's a major part of my mission is bringing back this balance and especially through the times that we're going to be going through and that we are going through now. So something made me think when I had that point where my heart was so broken but I knew it wasn't about the human issue because it was small and you know as we get more and more progressed in our clearing of things and I just really started but I'm already seeing a difference as as we can clear these emotions and we're gonna walk through that next but as we clear through those emotions then it, it's they don't happen as often and whenever a big one hits you know you know it well this felt like a gigantic one this felt like you know maybe your your seed 
issue that you've been carrying around for your whole entire life and you just poof figured it out and that's what type of reaction I had in my body and that was how my heart chakra just blew open and that's when I started asking my tribe um, member of the Sun Soul tribe what's up pimp in our matrix love you Maru um, if you're led to go find out what that is then you'll find us whenever you're ready but I started asking some of my tribe hey are y'all feeling this what's going on and everyone yes you know everyone's feeling some type of um, emotion deep 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 emotion and that's when it hit me you know this that was a collective heart chakra opening a heart chakra activation and by the time I linked it to 13 degrees Libra and I went with my tribe a little bit and read the degree for 13 degrees Libra I mean Sagittarius gosh Sagittarius 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 Venus was 13 degrees Sagittarius I might as well just start over right now I've got cosmic wit from Maru. <laughs> and she's my astrology teacher. 13 degrees Sagittarius. By the time I read the degree and looked back, she moved to 14 degrees. So that was a sign to me. Then there's going to be an emotion that you attach to this. It's either going to be an emotion, it's going to be a situation, it's going to be a test to whatever we were feeling this morning, right? Because we, we opened up our heart chakra. We allowed this, Venus was like, okay, you know, let's, let's, let's work on this. Let's clear some of this. My divine feminine goddesses and goddesses within gods. This is what we're doing. This, we're gonna, we're gonna go back. We've got a little bit till we kept up to Saturn. And we're moving fast. But we gotta think like Venus. We gotta clear those emotional, all those emotional templates right now. Right now, it's time. So whenever that heart chakra opened, there was a situation, there was something that happened in your life. I know it did. It, it, it was either attached to a thought, it was either attached to, for me, it was this situation with this person that, you know. So now let's think about that. So, so whenever you identify, all right, this is what it is. Think about that, okay. How am I letting that energy in? How do I feel about that energy? Um, do, do I interact with it face to face? Um, or is this some type of energy that I'm trying to, it's a situation where I'm trying to block this person away from me. And then today there was another trigger that, that brought it up and it's always from the outside looking in, right? Or is it that I know something's happening, but I just can't quite prove it. Or is it, I'm really not happy with myself and I just can't admit it to myself. Or is it, I know I should be on my mission, but I'm too scared to leave everything else behind and I don't know what's going to happen. Whatever it was, whatever it was, or if it keeps repeating, scale it back. So, and, and how did it get in there? Where was the thought process put there to begin with? Why do you feel that way to begin with? So for me, it was like, okay, why do I feel like a victim in this situation? That's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Well, because someone did this to me and this to me wrong and blah, 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 blah. Okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. Creator's taking care of me. I, th it doesn't matter. So thank you. Thank you, body, for... Thank you, brain, for catching that. Thank you, emotions and heart, for holding on to that. Thank you for protecting me whenever I was not protected before and for making me feel that way so that I have a reaction and um, I retreat or 
I move forward or whatever your situation may be, right? I hide, what, what, whatever, I, I, I eat, whatever. Thank you for that. But I don't need it anymore in the new energy. We're in a new energy. Body, I've been telling you we're in a new energy. This is it. This is it. This is Christ consciousness. We're here. We're angels. We're manifesting. We're star seeds. We're galactic warriors. So why did I have that thought? Forget it. Thank you. I love you. I love you for, for supporting me all this time. Now put it away. Put it away. And I put it away. And I stopped crying. And that's when I realized, holy crap, this was like a collective shift because that was a lot of energy for, for us to be transmuting for such a little thing. But if you don't know that, then you think, oh my gosh, something's crazy going on with me, right? Take a galactic perspective to every problem, to every situation. Realize that our bodies reacted to these situations by emotions that we don't need anymore. Draw a new paradigm. Your paradigms will change constantly. Draw a new paradigm that allows you with your full heart to believe what you say, that you love it and you release it, no matter what it is. No matter what it is. No matter who's killed who. No matter who's done what to you. You take the higher cosmic galactic perspective as to why it all happened because it made you who you are right now because most of us to be woken up had to get the shit beat out of us an awful lot so yeah and a lot of us are ancients and really 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 ancients and we've been here really been here a long time i don't know that might not supposed to <laughs> i just got a call <laughs> so i'm to piece these together uh, Thirteen was a significant number just because that's where Mercury is going to go. That's when it's going to turn. So we've got some time here that. I feel like what Venus is telling us is let's clear this crap. Let's all drop the victim. Let's all drop the male, female. Let's all drop the black, white, the Republican, the Democrat, the all of it. Let's drop the judgment. And if we're not ready to drop all of that right now, at this time, it'll be okay. But there's these little cool little tests that are happening and I hope I just gave you a little glitch. <laughs> so when you feel the emotion, just feel it, just feel it. And highest perception of how it can all work out and why it's there and why you needed the lesson and write it into your story as a positive on how it's going to make it to your next steps and believe 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 and realize there's some more shifts coming this is um 1212 there's there's another big shift of course on the winter solstice who knows you know around then there's 1221 I'm feeling some things, I'm 1222 for some reason. So, just wanted to give you a little heads up. That's what was going on today. If anything else pops up, I'll let you know. Synchronicities are off the chart. Um, look them up. Don't just, when you see a number, if you see 7777777, don't just say, oh, cool, sevens. Google it. Let let your your electronic devices quantum technology let it speak with you
and maybe I'll do one on that tomorrow. Um, let me know if you want me to do a video on that, on, on how I receive um, messages and, and information through technology that, that I know is meant for me and how those synchronicities fall up. If, if you want to hear that, then just comment. Thank you, thank you, thank you all for all your comments. They were so wonderful. So wonderful. Please subscribe. Please subscribe. I know you forget. I forget too. It means a lot to us that um, are on the ledge, jumping off, to at least know that y'all are want to hear more. So if you do, please subscribe. If not, I'll see you later anyway. Um, can I get a whoo whoo? And all my trillion angels sing. Amen. Ooh. And so it is. Mwah. Have a great day. Ancient and we've been here really been here a long time. I don't know, that might not supposed to I just got a call. So I'm to piece these together. Uh Thirteen was a significant number just because that's where Mercury's gonna go. That's when it's gonna turn. So we've got some time here that I feel like what Venus is telling us is let's clear this crap. Let's all drop the victim. Let's all drop the male, female. Let's all drop the black, white, the Republican, the Democrat, the all of it. Let's drop the judgment. And if we're not ready to drop all of that right now, at this time, It'll be okay. But there's these little cool little tests that are happening and I hope I just gave you a little glitch. <laughs> so when you feel the emotion, just feel it, just feel it. And highest perception of how it can all work out and why it's there and why you needed the lesson and write it into your story as a positive on how it's gonna make it to your next steps and believe, 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 believe and realize there's some more shifts coming. This is 1212, um, 12. There's, there's another big shift, of course, on the winter solstice, who knows, you know, around then there's 1221. I'm feeling some things, some 1222 for some reason. So, just wanted to give you a little heads up. That's what was going on today. If anything else pops up, I'll let you know. Synchronicities are off the chart. Um, look them up. Don't just, when you see a number, if you see seven, 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 don't just say, oh, cool, sevens. Google it. Let, let your, your electronic devices, quantum technology, let it speak with you. And maybe I'll do one on that tomorrow. Um, let me know if you want me to do a video on that, on, on how I receive um, messages and, and information through technology that, that I know is meant for me and how those synchronicities fall up. If, if you want to hear that, then just comment. Thank you, thank you, thank you all for all your comments. They were so wonderful, so wonderful. Please subscribe, please subscribe. I know you forget, I forget too. It means a lot to us that um, are on the ledge, jumping off, to at least know that y'all are wanna hear more. So if you do, please subscribe. If not, I'll see you later anyway. Um, can I get a hoo hoo? And all my trillion angels sing, amen. Ooh. And so it is. Mwah. Have a great day.